Thank you, Annalise. Listen to this. A local high school student has received numerous awards for his artistic ability. 7 News reporter Taylor Long shares how senior Josh Van Horn got started and how his artistic ability doesn't fall far from the family tree. Brook High School has their very own award-winning artist. Senior Josh Van Horn placed first in the Science and the Arts Challenge at the West Virginia State Science and Engineering Fair, received honorable mention for his piece for the Dreams and Nightmares show at Summit Art Gallery, and won the Recycling Coalition of the West Virginia Annual Freedom Contest. The theme of it was it all comes back to you. So I decided to take magazines and recycle them and I cut them up and made a self-portrait out of them and to sort of inspire people that you can make anything with recycled materials. And in January of this year, he placed first in mixed media at the Regional Student Art Exhibit at the Stifle Fine Arts Center. He submitted his recycled portrait and a piece he titled Addiction. A piece related to uh, skull smoking shaded in with the word addiction a, a bunch of times and the background included like a collage of articles about people dying and bad things happening because of it. He says he really got into art his sophomore year during COVID. With nothing to really do he said he started drawing more and it turned into a passion of his. I ended up just painting my room. I did like an entire wall and uh, that's kind of where it started. From there I just started drawing more and then I couldn't really get away from it. And his artistic ability doesn't fall too far from the family tree. His dad, Jamie Van Horn, shows his creative style in the cars he designs. And his grandfather, Lee Van Horn, worked in the mill and painted murals. And he also spent years creating snow sculptures in his front yard. My family is a great inspiration to me. They helped show me that it was possible, you know. And they kind of blow me away with the stuff that they have done, so... Hopefully I can do the same with them <laughs> one day. I think it's always really excited when you get someone who's passionate about art and has talent in your class. And it's been exciting to have Josh. Um, he's fun. He adds a lot of excitement to the classroom. His artwork is, it's exciting. You know, he's always doing something different and edgy and um, it draws people in. Josh says he wants his art to be more than just what someone looks at. He says his goal is to portray a feeling. I want you to see my art and not just think, oh, this kid's talented. I want you to think, I, I want you to feel something. You know what I mean? I want you to feel what I was feeling in that moment. That's, that's my main goal is to make people feel when they see my art. Reporting in Brook County, Taylor Long, working for you. Thank you, Taylor. Josh has plans to attend West Liberty after high school to better his arting skills. In the upcoming months, he plans to release a music album and publish a portfolio with his most recent artwork.